friendly greetings. Starting in Second Life 1.23, if you wondered where some additional camera sliders went in your preferences in the input and camera tab, they haven't been nuked forever. They're actually in the advanced menu. And once you go to the advanced menu and debug settings, one of them happens to be if you type in zoom time, that's 0.4 seconds. And if you're not sure what that means, let me show you. So this used to be known as camera transition time, which makes sense given its name. That's when, say for instance, I move far out like this and I press the escape key to zoom back in. Now, if I change this to say four, you're gonna notice that it takes four seconds now instead of 0 0.4 for me to zoom out on one motion and see it's still going. When I press escape now, that can be a pretty neat effect for making machinima cinematic pans and perhaps other usages. Generally setting it too high isn't very practical, but you can go up to 40 seconds. And if you're ever uncomfortable with that and wanna know what it was, click reset to default. Goody. Now the other one is camera position smoothing like this, which was the same as camera smoothing slider. So it's got a one there. Just pump your camera in and out to check out Des. And if you change this to say 10, now it's gonna feel more like it's skating or has a type of feather on it. See, I'm clicking, holding and releasing like that. So it glides like that. Let's compare that with one second. Notice how it stops suddenly. And again, this might be used for machinima. If I set it to something ludicrous like 100, watch what it does now. It's gonna, that's a bit crazy. Let me, oh, yeah, that isn't very desirable, but it keeps, it's skating, it's skating in just like that. Again, looks cinematic and control of your camera is really, really important. So you can reset that as well, should you decide you don't want it. But for all you power users out there, remember we do not support these debug settings. They can be removed at any time at our discretion, but it's cool if you want to tweak something. So at your own risk and leisure, happy tweaking.